During the New Republic's attempt to secure shipyards belonging to enemy forces behind our front lines, Jedi Master Corrin Horn succumbed to several blaster wounds. The shipyards were secured, but an inquiry is being started as to what led to this tragedy. Alright, so Corrin's sacrifice will not be forgotten, but we are about to start invading some Imperial territory. So let's get uh, these guys moving in the right direction, but first I'm actually going to send... Luke and Mara and Lando that direction. We're going to send you guys up here. And we're also going to get Nance moving for the first time in a while over to there with our ground forces ready to follow up on that. Uh, but we have to keep an eye on our infrastructure a little bit. We're still building in a lot of places. But let's see. I'm going to get... The... That... We've got tax agencies building on those. I think just to get under some extra ground capacity. Let's slop those up. Especially with heavy vehicles, having more of these planets that are able to build faster. It's going to fill some gaps for us. So we got to Araco first. Hopefully this will be a relatively simple lossless Praetor kill. Uh, I wonder if I can make it focus away from us. All right, let's see what we can do with Defatigable. No, let's put it in an Agave over there. Ready for action. Ahead full. Standing by. And see if I can Underway. bait them in. Okay, beautiful, position. beautiful, beautiful. Moving out. It's coming. Get On back there. I want to be able to just drop in behind it. Oh, yes. Keep, keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Just to protect us from some of the initial power. And now, there. let's do it. All right. We're going. Right we have grift off. Right away. Increase the On my way. Right away. All right. Go for it. Beauty of Ryloth's in. Bigger fish. Kraken can't draw. Way of the road. And he was an MCA boy. Your All right. Targeting. Get that as fast as possible. Awaiting your command. Are you getting the brunt of it? And let's get power to weapons. I'm going to use the turning time when the shields are still up in order to hit those. Like, pick the, the major targets. So the other benefit of going in from the side like this is we'll be able to focus on the weapons on one side and hopefully... With that being the case, we'll stop, like, we'll get to the point where there's no weapons that can actually shoot us. So, we'll just use its, uh, use its big size, use its pop cap, use all those factors against it. Because we can start hitting some of these weapons that are going to be next to shoot us, and just make them, uh... Make them all a non-factor. A big sitting goose. Alright. We want to get anti-hardpoint weapons. Otherwise, our Star Destroyer will not be standing by. Mm. Okay, make sure you get those. There we go. That. Hit that no back corner. All right, Praetor down. The lasers are our target. You're going to stop there. I don't think... Well, I think we actually did maybe lose some Awaiting smaller ships. We've, we, we, I think we might have lost something. All right, let's get that before it can jump away. And now we get the goal in. All right, we're off to a good start. So, oh, that's actually a problem. You right can get back here, and then that's not what I want. Gavis, over to, to the poor little... You need to stop, otherwise... If the Golan destroys that ISD when I saved it from the Praetor, I'm actually going to be upset with myself. Alright. 
Destroy Here, get that one first. The lasers are our target. Give the word. Waiting orders. Okay. Hopefully Merc here will be similar opportunity. We did lose the Agave that we sent in to sacrifice, but if we'd gone like head on, we probably would have lost a capital ship. Like it would have had more time to get through, whether it's the ISD or something else. Like I, I think that that strategy speaks for itself. Even though I spent like 20 minutes speaking about it. All right, Take out the there we go. So, two agaves and a warrior. That's really fine for what we just killed, especially with our economy being in a much better place than it was uh, during the last attempts. But I'm gonna keep getting together some of those spies. Ooh, okay. If we have to retreat from some of these battles, then that's what we'll do. Like, if I can just keep hitting them where they're a little bit weaker, Incoming. like hitting 200 pop fleets, maybe 300 pop fleets, are kind of, like, as long as there's nothing else, are kind of the goal. This isn't actually that bad. Uh, yes, sir. I'm gonna move. Tello must be going. Uh, a lot of anti fighter. With a hyper velocity gun. Hmm. One allegiance, one secular. Hold on, what's that actually add up? There's 50, there's 110. So this is actually. I think we do outnumber here. So let's try to. take out some of this anti fighter a bit sooner. Alright, sorry, hello, I must be going. We got Home 2, Spirit of Santa, Winnie the Pooh, 2 for Flinching, Prosperous Unification, Chili Healer, and I love you. Turn on that power. I actually don't like this angle. Okay, let's, uh, let's try to just take out that. And like being a little bit farther back would be nice, because we're just going to have Nance taking a lot of havoc. So let's retreat. There's no reason to give him up. I don't think they'll be able to take out his shields. And if I'd been maybe a bit farther back and had to like funnel them in a bit, then that'd be better. But we took maybe a couple, a Carrick and a Tonfalk for Hello, I Must Be Going. Not ideal. We're getting back to Rocco with them. Well, okay, that's fine. I'm gonna move. Construction complete. No, no. Construction complete. Leave Hera. Moving out. Don't overlap. Because we can just get these ground forces in. Right away, so there's a spy. Let's go to Ord Trassi. Okay, Ord Trassi and Yaga Miner are both up there. CSA took Bandomir. Uh, so we need Mandalore, we need Axilla, and we need Cutric. Those are the ones there. Uh, so I'm, I think I'm gonna build up that. And if we just go through Ord Radama with the Viscount, oh, your old ground stuff. Complete. I don't know that we'll want to conquer Ord Radama, but we'll go through Ord Radama. And that's, I think that's Galaxy Rose. I don't think that's actually the Viscount because this is the Viscount. Because this, the Viscount itself, we're going to Mandalore. So get over there. We're coming to Champala. Uh, with that fleet. Okay, so let's, uh... Let's take this. Take Arako. And then I'll try to send Nance back to Seafkree. Maybe we'll hit part of that fleet, but it shouldn't be the same amount. Sir. Moving into position. So we'll capture this turret, and I don't know if we'll be able to grab another landing zone. We have the resources for those, so let's uh let's get around to this corner. 
Let's go. Keep going. Yes, sir. This way. And what's that? Okay, that's the planetary shield. There's a turbo laser that's going to be in there as well. But I think everything's going to be kind of distracted. Yes, sir. Right away, sir. Oh, that's an AT-AT? Right that is actually scary. Uh, don't actually take cover yet. Alright. Here we go. Turn around. Up there. Can I actually land anything in here? Let's just go heavy infantry on this. And a seize, and then some more infantry. Because we want to be able to take out the factory before anything else gets into it, so... Uh, you're going to stay there. And let's pull that back. All right. So take out the heavy vehicle factory before another AT-AT comes in. Can I get maybe repairs over here? No, you guys can actually stay. You're going to go and get repairs over there. So that'll also be the planetary shield. This version of the map, much closer to the base game one. There were some other edits that we talked about with like the version we had that you start kind of over there. But oh well. All right. Just get into the base. Uh, I did want those repairs. So I'll just send them to do it. I think having the AACs in the back is probably better. But if we can just power weapons up through. Okay, go to where you're going to be healed. And let's see if we can get to the next, uh, the next factory. Okay. Don't let that explode on you. You know that's what it wants to do. There we go. Okay, nobody take cover. Need to go up faster. Ooh. So, as much as I want to get in before the T, or before the AT, AT comes back, I think we're probably just gonna have to take out this. Otherwise, the the, the chariot LAV, yeah, they're already in. The chariot LAVs are just gonna come in and do bad things. Are you healed up? You are healed up. Really, just got everyone locked into their base. That might hit everything. Yeah. All right. Nice. So, can everyone just, uh, go even further? Reporting. All these independents. Okay. Good. System control achieved. All right, we can start building. finally building some of that up. Now, Nance, do you want to maybe redeem yourself with, uh, Tactical battle that? Event. Okay, we got to work for Dama. I wanted to cut this off because, like, they're cut off at Tangrain. So if we can just take out any of their space here. stuff here, then they can't invade one of our planets. But it looks like that's not going to be a concern for much longer. Like, they don't actually have their Tangrain. capital, and their uh, their upkeep is probably going to be fairly high, even on Cruel, which does redu reduce upkeep. But we got Suzano and Hail the King. We have Iron Hand of Coruscant. Alright. But, uh, the, so yeah, the, the Mandalorian playthrough should actually be starting very soon, with this one being closer to conclusion. Oh, that, they also, they won't be able to, to build anything if they have a... a ship market here if they don't get enough rolls for that so that is the downside of them going heavier into ship markets too uh but yeah so the the mandalorian playthrough will be starting uh fairly soon once this concludes there's some work that i still need to do uh for either some of the units or some of the maps that we're going to be using but 
as soon as that's ready, I like when this episode goes up, I will actually be uh, about to be away for a couple days. Once I'm back, that'll be my my primary focus. I, I spoke about it a bit in the stream schedule posting, but uh, part of me going away is trying to get ahead on work for all the channels. But I, I want to try to stay ahead on work in a way that I haven't been for a while. Like I've been doing videos generally week of for the last year or two. And I, I want to have a bigger, a bigger buffer so that I can work on stuff that's a bit more time intensive without it just being like a scramble to always get stuff out. Proceeding. You are there. And I want her to go to Seafkri. As much as I want to get them off of Ethor, I think it's more important to go to Seafkri. I think Yavin 4, too. Well, I can... I'm going to Yavin with this fleet. Star Destroyer reporting in. We got to Mandalore. Okay, so they actually sent Mercury to Mandalore. I didn't really... I don't know why I didn't register as all this stuff being right next to each other. But if that is the same fleet, then we're in good shape. Enemy forces ahead. So let's get the Viscount, take out that Secutor. Radis, come on in there. And which one hasn't been used? Impetus, Spurious. Impetus wasn't used in the last battles. That's Anorok. Some anti-fighter. And get some healing. Alright, you're getting in there. So I want to try to make sure these guys stay kind of intact, stay kind of back. But if you can take out some of these side ones, like go for the strike cruiser first. I'm going to make sure take this down. Because Galaxy's Rose's fleet is going to be primarily looking to get uh, get to Axilla? Like we kind of got... Nope. Stop there. Stop there. You are going a little bit further up than I'd intended. I don't know if we'll actually be able to finish this off. I think we can. It's not really that big of a fleet. And we're still going to have full shields going into the station. So, yeah, as long as you guys are protecting some of our interests on that side. If we're getting some incidental fire from the Viscount over there, you're focusing on this. Let's get these bombers onto that victory and like, there, there's still an exec executor somewhere out there or anorak it'll be responsible for one of these shipyards being taken at least all right that's all exploding I've basically removed the lifetime limit uh, for a lot of the patron units. It was in the in this playthrough. Unfortunately, there was a, a coding bug that was stopping them from getting put back into the pool the way they were supposed to. But for the CIS one, for the Mandalorian one, all that stuff is uh, is fixed. And what I really want to be able to do is set it up so that I can inject new ships into the the patron list as the game goes on because. Like, for other stuff that gets added a bit later, uh, I generally have to make them separately buildable the way I used to handle it. I've lost engine two. But, because blue scripts are just how they are when they're loaded, but if I can make a thing that, like, reads in, just adds to the list without having to, like, replace the original script... Uh, or update the original script in the same way, then I think I can finagle it so that I can... I can make that work. I think. 
It'll be a bit messy, setting it up, but I like that kind of thing. Like, I like being able to try to think creatively about something, to do something stupid. <laughs> that is what makes me mod. Alright, so we are actually nearly through the station. So... That might mean that Nance is freer to act in that region, too. So if we can get... Uh, if we can get Nance... From Seafcree back to Merkir... Then... I'll be happy with that. Thank you, Sushi Defender, for your... For your sushi service. I have never actually eaten sushi. I don't know if that's another of my bad food takes that people get so upset about. But I thought I, I'd give you all the opportunity to bully me. That's what I'm really doing this channel for. Opportunities to bully me. Uh, you're going to be down, I think, below 90%. I think we might have to... It's close. It's close, but we might have to do some time in the repair yards for him. All right. Okay. The rest are the rest are ion cannon. So if it's not below ninety percent now, it's not going to get below ninety percent. Uh. It might be ninety percent to get to the yellow. I think Mord might have changed some of that when he was playing with the the health bars a few months ago. That might actually be the rule. But now, like, I I don't know. I might be making things up. No, I know too much, but not enough. There we go. So Vertag's army coming in here could be a good idea. I don't like that they got to Galanor. We lost a couple guys there, including Anorak. But overall, that's a success. I'll have to loop them around if I want to do that. Let's do that this way. Did I actually give the movement order? I did. We're about to invade Adumar again, too. Uh, do we have the Starhawk there? We do have the Starhawk. I am going to... Tactical battle. Deploy... Oh, never mind. They still outnumber us significantly. Even though things are, are going better for us than they were, like, we're still enemy. at a numerical disadvantage, and it's going to take some... Uh, take some doing to, to reverse that. So let's see if we can get over here. Let's see if we can lure them in. Go home to Spirit of Santa, Chili Healer, Winnie the Pooh, Prosperous Unification, two for flinching. Love you, a VSD one. Because we're pulling them into a choke point here. Like I'm not expecting to be able to win on this, but I am expecting to take take some out. All right, I want you to get that strike cruiser. Yes, Commander. Uh, E-wings out there. A wings, E wings, all bombers going that way. All right, everyone else, stop here. Ready for your orders. Moving there now. Ready and willing. We do this for the new republic. We might actually be able to push further in. Roger that. All right, get you guys. Because we are going to be going head on into. A Praetor, if it comes to that, I want you to stop. How can we be of I want you to stop as well. And I'm going to pull you back. Alright, X-Wings on that. We're slowly inching towards threats from the... Yes, from the Praetor. There's a lot of anti-fighter that's over there, plus their own fighters. Here comes another ISD. Fly away. Alright, they're retreating some of the... Those... Carriers. 
I'm gonna try to get the Praetor. That. Alright. Two for flinching, getting back there. Yes, Commander. Nebula class on I can't see him. Cruiser reporting. Yes, Admiral. Like the the fight with Hera made me a little hesitant. There's just so much anti-fighter that's actually over there too. Awaiting orders. Yes, General. Rockets away. All right, stop on that. Are we actually getting any response? No. All right, let's go for the let's go for the carriers first then. So we're gonna take up the engines. All right, that should be enough on that one. There we go. Oh yeah. The next one. I think too many of the bombs were sent out. But if we kill everything except for the the Praetor, that's also. A noteworthy success. Take out their right, I think you're actually in range to to get those. Right, we're starting to pull in the Praetor. See if we can push that off. Well, they can't retreat that way. That should get it. Okay, get this next one. And... Mm. Alright, let's go. Hopefully we don't lose the engines on this VSD. If we do, that's not the end of the world. It, it would make it a less worthwhile battle. But I think we're good. Yep. Spirit of Santa, I think, survive... Or not Spirit of Santa, the other thing. Okay, let's, uh... Enemy fleet approaching. Those. All right, and they're coming for Rivester, too. Well, okay, let's, uh... Let's get that. Never mind. Do we have an ion cannon? We don't have an ion cannon. They have, what, six ISDs plus the allegiances. It's 451. Or 326. And this isn't the fleet that we have something particularly defensive on either. Oh, fun. That's all cut off, too. All right. So wait, the how many, how many allegiances were here? Any allegiances? No allegiances. We got stamina, revenge of the Jedi, water into wine, gray ghost, broody hen, calamitous. Ready and willing. Endurance on station. Stamina. Yes, All right, solve. Get back up there. We actually have a lot of anti fighter. So let's uh let's move up to the. Let's move up to the asteroids. Sov, you're gonna stay there. Let's put our fighters and bombers in the asteroids. I have the concepts of a plan. Asteroids ahead. Okay, there no, there is there is an elite. So this one had three. I was I wasn't sure if I was thinking of the four in the other one or if there were any. So uh, I just I, I psyched myself out. Reporting. Roger that. Okay, if, as they come around that way, we're coming up here. Why wing here? Form up. And we're gonna start bombing them. Okay, yes, sir. Guys, Ready. you there, and then we're sending all these guys around that way. And we're gonna get the bombing damage in on that. Alright, all of you go up this way. We're going ring around the asteroids. 
Kupanua. Proceeding to coordinates. Patikana. Squadron, moving and out. this grouping Full speed. boost. I got Just try to get some damage on these away. and then around. How can we be of service? At your command. I don't like how much they're getting onto this MT90. Reporting. But let's get up to this next one. Wings. Like, ISDs are fast. Is the thing. Going for the engines on that, though. I can't see him. Hold on. That's got him. Your orders, sir? We can't lose. We're going to get pinched. So, I'm just going to go. We made a bit of a point, but like if I'd stayed long enough to kill that ISD, we would have lost one of our other units. So like it's still it's still a bit on the edge. We lost a warrior in the starbase, and they're coming for Yavin. Um. A lot of bikes, but I think we might be able to get through there. Heavy trooper back in okay. Business. We're going to be taking this. We're going to get a bunch of turrets. Beginning construction. Arm the turrets. Set them you guys have got to speed your way up. Yes, sir. Right away. Like they're all so isolated from the rest of their forces. We gained a command post. Beginning construction. Heavy trooper ready for action. Death to the Reporting. empire. Moving ahead. Get up there. Construction complete. Hmm. Construction yeah. complete. Where can I get some turret? Okay, there's 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 a turret. Give me the word, sir. Hang on. I want to get everything to up to Coming that around. point if I can. Yes, sir. Heading out, sir. All right. I'm get on that. Get on that. I want this build pad. I'll turn this into repairs. The enemy is Is it's gonna be secured a build pad. A lot of repairs necessary. Constructing. Disappearing on the ground. There we go. But it's seven companies of bikes. Everyone else can get up. Uh, there's... Ooh, right. Chariots, I do need to... Handle. Don't let them blow up. Don't let it blow up. There you go. Don't let that one come in and blow up either. Stop it. There we go. So I think there's going to be eight of the PX4s because there are four companies of them. And I think they come in uh, yes, commander. companies of two. Yes, commander. Ball out, troops. Ready. Now Moving get up out. there. One. I think one. Yes, commander. You get back and heal. All right. Let's not. Uh, let's not get too far up there. This is where all of our our stuff is. And there is going to be a bombing run soon. So I have to keep that in mind. And you guys can keep coming up there. Nope. Get that. It, don't turret. You don't need to get that. All right. Get that. Get the get the chariot. Get the chariot. Get the chariot. All right. Now let's pull over this way. Just in case a bombing run decides to come. Here comes another company of bikes. Wide open. 
here. And if I have us moving a lot, then chances are we're not going to get hit by a, a bombing run. There's one, two, three, four. Okay, this might be the end of them. Oh, that's five. So maybe that is the end of them after this group. Just gotta keep an eye on the on the bottom corner of the map. Wait, did they have any? It was just was it just the the four allegiances? So it wouldn't be they wouldn't have any bombing runs unless they brought something else in. So I think I just have to wait until, or I think I'm safe until a bom or bombardment. All right, get those. We might have actually killed everything. Almost. Get it. Uh, I don't know if that's going to be enough. Got three of them. All right, we're going over to Selenon. Tactical battle. We're not. Can have Galanor, I guess. System lost. Maybe I should upgrade some of these defenses just in case they decide to keep going with that. Um. Well, Seafcre is open again because it was just the one Praetor left there. Now you're gonna go that way. Hmm. This is going to be harder without the actual units on the ground, but it's still a lot of chariots. Let's hopefully be able to hold it, because we have a lot of factories. The enemy has been spotted. And we're fast. Take down. Arm the a lot of partisans. I was about to say I'm not sure where we got a Keldor model, but then I remembered I made it for Plocoon. The texture is uh, missing, though. I wonder if it just wasn't brought over from Fall of the Republic, because Plo is the only Keldor we have, and he's obviously only in Fall of the Republic. So whenever someone put the partisan together for that, they just forgot to move that over. All right. Let's go. Hang on. We're kind of relying on a lot of upfront damage. Right, sir. Away, sir. So we're we're going heavily with missiles. All right. Let's move back a little bit. And hopefully that saves us. Okay, we're about to have that up. Mm. Oh, okay. The self-destruct on the chariot lab has probably done more damage to us recently than anything else. You're not carrying anyone. You just explode. Not on us, though. I'm kind of just relying on the turrets to... Damn, they're going to get nothing. <laughs> Good try. Like, we're pretty loaded up on turrets from our prior defenses here. Right, let's try to get into the middle. Too bad they're slightly farther away than that. Luckily, like, these are not the best for anti-infantry, especially. But the Candorous tanks are actually a threat. I wonder if I can pull them into anti-vehicle turret? Probably not. Okay, let's just try to take this out. And see if you stay in range. 
Doesn't look like they are, but... Okay, let's pull you back a bit so you can just get a little bit more reliable healing. Like, not really more reliable healing, but so you don't take the... The same damage from them. The distance will at least cause some inaccuracy. Pulled out a little bit there. All right, let's send in more support. All right. We're actually, that actually works pretty well for the RAF. And like, we're getting back to a, a higher mass of vehicles of our own. So as much as I'm afraid of the Candorous, I am getting less afraid of the Candorous. All right, let's try to get that. All right, get out of there. Uh, didn't even kill our... our repairs. Okay. Let's, uh, let's get these over here. Nope, pull back, pull back, pull back. Thanks, Pathy. Come on. Get it to get closer. We need them closer. I think those will get it, and then, nope, Candorous. Well, we need to stop them from getting that other landing zone. So let's try to stay over there. And I think there's still infantry that made it over here. Maybe not. Oh, they were, they're getting stopped. Uh, here comes more of their landing forces. Okay, get over to that side, and let's back together over here. Okay. Spread out some more then. The enemy bombardment is in fact ready. That's not something we want exploding on us. Alright. Uh Okay, up to the bridge. That exploded something on us. Okay. There's the one Candorous. Another chariot lav rush. Alright. Still gotta rely on our ACs for this. Uh I wonder if we'll get another RAF. Okay, well that's nearly done. Come on, last. Come on, this way. Pull away too. I think we've taken maybe four of their companies out. All right, let's get uh, let's get back to these. And I'm gonna get rid of that. I think we might get one more RAF. I'm not sure. I'm going to try to get repairs. Uh, here, and then repair. I don't know that they're going to have the units to... The, the units to, to take out the base. As bad as the explosions are from the... From the chariots, they are explosions. They don't get to use them after that. There you go. All right, we got him in range of more of the turrets. Stop it. Okay. We gotta let that turret tank a little bit. Okay, let's back off again. And do I have other infantry here? I do. Nope. Get back. They're getting closer and closer to the base, but I think we're kind of dealing with the final waves of them. 
We do have a lot of turrets in here. Nope. No. Oh, crap. That's gonna kill everything. I'm just trying to order them away, but it's gonna be close. No more explosions. Please. All right, I don't think we get any more RAFs. There we go, okay. Good. Lost all of our turrets, but we got all of their units. And I suppose I'll wanna build up Wedge, just in case. Adamar is getting attacked as well. All right, final defense for the day. There's Rogris though, too. Hmm. All right, hopefully our last defense on Adamar as well. Uh, we're gonna send some of you over that way. Go up here. Copy. Keep going. Ready for battle, sir. Like the center is always the sticking point for this. I'm gonna try to get up to the other areas. Reporting. You're good to go. We captured a command post. Alright, let's get a field base. I should have probably gotten the other one for that. Right, let's try to go over here with our some of our faster stuff. Enemy units sighted. Oh, get repairs on this. Damn, they're gonna take that landing zone. Well, one of you can go and get us some money. Your orders. And then we'll get the rest over there. Okay. Uh let's just go up the middle. Because they seem to be focusing elsewhere. I don't want our ACs to get killed there. Oh, never mind. All right, take cover. Don't go faster. And then we'll have, like, we'll be able to win this once we have everything together. But can't let them get that. Okay, T4s getting closer. Our bestest guys are fairly slow right now. All right, the command bases are down. Let's try to get over there. Can you guys maybe capture that? I don't know if they'll be able to. I'm gonna have some of these ones over here building up some turrets to maybe stop them. But there you go. I need all these tanks to move as fast as they slowly can. Yeah, we're starting to pull them in from other sides. Alright, come on up there, because there's some infantry to deal with. And infantry, I want you to go back. Like, you're in front right now, but that's not great. Awaiting orders. Right away. I need you to actually survive in order to do what I want. What are they bombing? Alright, infantry, keep looping around the top of this and get over there. While our vehicles get forward this way. Probably do need to leave some of these around because they're they're starting to come in behind us. Yes, sir. Let's go. Yes, Okay. Uh. Back there. Let's sell this. Try to get those before they destroy anything too important. I'm here, sir. Keep going. All right. This will be ours, and I'm gonna start moving up here. Uh, I'll send some of those up there, too. 
So, I want a field base. Leave that. And keep going around. This will be anti-vehicle, and you're going to pause there. Or take cover, not pause. I'd like to get in the bunker. Okay, go on up, and then you guys go on down. This might not be a hold for us. We'll be able to get a turret. Just gonna kind of let that fall. Okay, let's actually send all these down. And don't take cover. Uh, okay, take that. I just need these to be alive. And everyone else go in. There you go. Uh, so we have the turret. We've got most of these around. They're not going to have the landing zone. Okay, now you guys get in. So let's go down the bridge. And we'll have them surrounded. One of you I'm going to send to capture whatever's over there. And the rest of you are going up here. Because I just need to make sure we don't let them get the... Uh, I that was coming. Gotta make sure they don't get the other landing zone. Because that's what's important. They have nowhere to land. They cannot expand. Uh, oh, can you actually kill those? That is important. Alright, we actually, I think we're holding again. I didn't think that would work. But we got everything. Ooh. Is that all they have? Once that's gone, I think we win. Maybe. Where... Where do they have any units left? Uh... Okay, go up here. I'm gonna get sensors somewhere. And... They, they've got to have someone running around somewhere. Go up there. Oh, they have a PX4 here. I think they've, they've been trying to capture it, and they just haven't deployed them from the... from the unit. There we go. There we go. Or a mobile... Yeah, it was PX4. All right, that is going to do it for today's episode. Uh, next episode is apparently going to kick off with retreating from this battle again, but thank you for watching as we get to the the end stages, I think, of the campaign. There should be, I think, probably two episodes left would be my bet, but thank you again for watching. Hope to see you next time. Bye, everyone.